Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to rank 5 of the F-123 Williams Road to Glory. Yesterday we returned here for the Miami GP of course. If you missed out on the video that went live earlier on this week I believe, I would highly recommend going back and checking it out. But yeah, tonight though we return to Miami of course. All these races done live over on my Twitch. Um, so hopefully tonight we're going to be hitting 5,000 followers as well over there. But championship wise then, Verstappen still leading the way. 94 points there. Uh, 27 clear of his teammate Sergio Perez. Hamilton up to P3 after a good result last weekend. We're tied with Alfa Romeo. Three points apiece there. As you see, Albon has got two points to my one. Uh, we are currently sat in 16th place in the Drivers' Championship after I finally broke my duck last weekend in Azerbaijan. Jam Baku, but Miami, I really like. I think it's quite a good fun circuit. So hopefully tonight we can have a good race. If you're new around here, get yourself subscribed. Like I said, follow the Twitch link down in the description below, and let's do this thing. Right. Anyway, first qualifying run coming up. I need to focus because again, I need to actually deliver in qualifying. Sisu, thank you for the follow. Um, Matt did set predictions. Get your bets in, and let's try and go for a banker lap here in Miami. Let's not go for a banker lap here in Miami. Oh, that's close. Right, let's go again then. I got 1.2 laps worth of fuel. Hopefully this time around I'm not going to bottle it. I, I just kind of wanted to go high risk. Why does the back end feel so loose? Feels worse than qualifying free practice through those first couple of corners. Not a particularly good line through the chicane, but, you know, we have to get on with it coming. Andrea Stella, we trust. He's done a fantastic job turning that team around. You cannot argue against it. I don't think any of us, when it was kind of confirmed, thought, wow. But he's got the job done. Alpha Tari could very easily get a win if Red Bull just give them their car and don't show up. Right, at the final corner, what is the first time going to be? Am I slower than Lance Stroll? Yes, I'm slower than everyone. Deary me. A 130.4... And I said we could aim for a 28. So I want to try and out-qualify Albon. I think that's got to be the first goal. Uh, but, but I can't help but feel like this is not the track for Williams. You know, Baku was fantastic. Um, Miami might not be. But, like we said, we've got crazy conditions for the race. So even if I don't make it out of Q1, there's still plenty of opportunities for things to happen. It's a better line through the first couple of corners. Still not great, but better. Someone followed trying to throw me off. But I appreciate it. Alright, Cadence break in. That's better. Whoa. See, there we go. That's most of the time found. Uh, Fornit, thank you for the follow. Now we just got to be a bit brave around the rest of the lap. The Astri down to P16. I want to see Alex improve, but I don't think he has. Oh, no, I'm validated. Let's see what the lap time could have been. I haven't played the game in, like, a week. I don't think I've played it since the last episode, so, you know. Okay. Up over the line, 29-1. It's frustrating. It's frustrating. 29 Oh, we would have been, like, P13. Oh, that's annoying. Well, we've definitely got pace in the car, then. We have got pace to fight here, but it is last on the grid. I mean, that is ridiculously close come the end of Q1. Um, pretty much, yeah, from what? Perez down to Piastri, covered by three tenths of a second, is insane. Um, but we've got 57 laps to do it. We've got to get into the race. Um, here we are, though. Trackside ready for the Miami Grand Prix. And why is it recommending a three-stop? I don't quite know. We're going to start the race on some mediums, um, see when the rain's going to arrive, and we'll work our way from there. But I'm expecting safety cars. Uh, I'm, I'm also expected to make the race predictions uh, for Twitch chat. Right. Let's get ready then on the grid here for the Miami Grand Prix. Rain is already on the horizon. Starting P19, we're not even lining up last. I'm just that good at the game. We beat Zhou Guan Yu. But 57 laps ahead of us. Let's see what we can do come race day Sunday. Five red lights. Red lights out and away we go. Pretty clean, tidy start. Alvin's struggling apparently. 
Does Nick to freeze? Let me try and make... How have I not got damage there? I don't know. Joe Guan Yu is going to say thank you very much. I get a warning for a collision with Magnuson. I genuinely thought that was game over on turn one. But we survived. Now can we actually try and make some progress? Clearly Magnuson as well. Obviously on the harder tyres struggling as well. So we try and navigate our way. Have I not picked up damage? Is this car just this bad through the corners? Yes. Well, we're going to make an overtake though. Or attempt it. Down the inside of Magnuson. And we're going to put Hass into last place at the home Grand Prix. Uh, Verstappen isn't even leading, never mind winning this race. I can't really dive bomb, no, sadly. I I wasn't going to do a Perez yet, and I didn't need immediately hit Kevin Magnus out of all people, so. But I didn't give him front wing damage or spin him. Is he going to back out of it? Yes. Oh, oh, what is going on here? Alex? Let's try and gain some places. Thank you all. Up to the lofty heights of P17. Someone get me a band-aid. I got a nosebleed. That's not what you use for a nosebleed, but we're going for it. We are all in the trolley train. I believe it's Checo and Carlos Sainz going side by side, causing all this. So here comes okay. another car. I don't got no idea where to break. We're breaking there. That's okay. Charles Leclerc then leading at the end of lap one. Well, it already looks like then the top group is. Split, uh, spin, spinning out? Thinning out is the word I'm looking for. To freeze is the best nut driver. Matt, you seem not the kind of guy to stop the performance file with the red button and still be P17. Well, I'm beating my teammate, okay? So, you know what? Seems possible. So, we constantly get good traction out of there, and then the AI just uses loads of battery, which I should have joined them on. Here we go. Holgerberg to the inside of Nick de Vries. Are we going to see the Dutchman? Oh, well, there's contact. Hello. These two getting feisty with each other as Albon tries to look down my inside at the final corner. Can't make it happen. But eh, de Vries and Holgerberg getting the elbows out. Is de Vries going to come back at him? So Not quite. Oh, Hulk with a lockup, though. Rain still 10 to 15 minutes out. So we kind of got to hope that the soft compound runners can't get that far. That might be the best line I've taken through turn three all day. Oh, aye. There's more lockups coming in. I see Zhou and K-Mag as well at the back of the field battling. Um, I mean, we've, we've basically got six cars that are falling off the back. Um, no f no thanks to Hulkenberg and Nick DeFries here. So I think we need to try and navigate them and try to close up. Can we use some battery this time round? Try and get a run then on the Alpha Tauri. We're certainly going to attempt it. Try and get alongside him. Both of us closing in on Nico Elkenberg. Oh god, we're three wide. We're not three wide. I'm I'm backing out of that. Can we switch him? Oh, come on. Go in a straight line, please, car. Uh, De Freeze has completed the move again. I'm going to see Hulkenberg try it. Oh, Hulk uh, broke early. Uh. Singapore, I mean, Singapore and Miami are not particularly fun tracks on a controller. Uh, down the inside, though, of De Freeze. That's another one gained. Um, but are we going to see Oscar try and instantly get a run back on the Alfa Romeo? I'm not convinced he's going to have the speed. We're definitely going to have to conserve uh, fuel, though, for the rest of the afternoon. Which I will start doing right now. Tiny bit of front wing damage. I basically did what I did in Baku qualifying, where I'd let off and then just decide I'm not going to break anymore, which is not particularly helpful. Can I get a run, though, down the inside of Piastri at Turn 1? Yes, I will. We'll be very, very aggressive over the curbing, but we will claim it. So there's still more battles going on. As for the points, then. His ex-teammate, then. Oh, come on. Nose in. There's Piastri there. We'll try and get back up the inside. Just about hook it up. Still inside the DRS range as well. What are we saying about this rain? Well, no duh. What? Oh, oh, there we go. There's the rain instantly. My timing again tonight has been impeccable. That kind of thing. Where's the rain? Instantly starts raining. Uh, how bad is the rain going to get, though? It's the real question. As Gasly and Sonoda again side by side. This time around, Sonoda's not going to back out of it. We're kind of all just in a traffic jam. 
a traffic paradise. And how heavy is this rain going to get and how quickly is it going to do it? Okay, I think we're still the right tyres for the time being. It's been raining 10 seconds, of course we are. Uh, but that implies to me that we are going to see a change of conditions very, very soon. So we're going to try to look down the inside of Valtteri. What is that? AI moving around in the braking zone. They're all mad. Absolutely mad. But we'll have traction Valtteri on the exit. Up to P13 now of the race. But I don't think it's going to be long um, before we have to dive in onto a set of the intermediates. Rain or sweat on the visor. Who knows? Here goes Oscar. Oh, we're there I... How is that a warning? I slid down the wall. Ugh! We saved it. We're good. I'm definitely boxing the end of this one. Right, come on then. Let's see if we can try and get a run back on Oscar though. There's obviously no AI into the pit lane though. So, still... Don't believe it's wet enough yet. Nice 11s is down the back straight. Oh, come on. Left with nowhere to go on the exit. But... I don't believe it's the right call, Mark. We are going to try and dive in slightly early. Um, right. Yeah, this is this is quite a gamble, though, on just lap 13. But we've got to try and do something to make up some of the time. Uh, F1XL Norris, thank you for the follow. Yeah, we'll pit Seaside and have the right idea. Right, let's go. Come on. That was a fantastic stop. Faster than we were expecting. Yeah, it's look definitely... I mean, look at the puddle. What? Race on this compound. Why am I on hards? Oh, I'm such a moron. I never changed it. Oh, I'm so thick. If the AI will box now. Right, okay, now we're in trouble, chat. Now, now we're in trouble. How did I not manage that? Oh, I'm so stupid. Bottle job 212 strikes again. L plan, yeah. I'm such a moron. That was Ferrari S. Yeah, there we go. So we would have nailed the pit stop as well. Sorry? How did the, the AI. 2.2, uh, we'll take it. The crew there just teleporting their way around. Right, all we can hope is there's an Alpine and a Merck still out there that they can hold everyone up. If the team is delighted by that as well, why didn't they do it one lap earlier? Right, come on then. Let's actually try and make an overtake happen. Let's try and get a run on Joe Guan Yu. We're still floating on the fuel. But, to be honest, I'm kind of hoping we get we stay in these intermediate conditions. I haven't completed the move, Mark. Where is Joe getting that pace from? He is driving scary. Is he going to have a look down the inside? Yes, he is. Oh, there's contact between the Alphas. So, oh, don't bin it. Don't bin it. Come on. Can we get a run on the pair of Matt at the final corner? That's what we need to be looking for. Joe's going to go defensive. Oh, he's locked up and I'll have two for the price of one. Thank you very much. Uh, both our from O's then in one go there. A little bit of contact as Joe tried to come back to the racing line. DRS now enabled. That seems early. Um, but I guess we'll probably be boxing at the end of this lap then. That seems awfully early still, but we'll take it. Oh! Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it. Alexander's coming in for his stop now. I... It's been a while since I played F123. It's all I'm going to say. I'm still convinced you constantly use flashback software. But this is the thing, like, I'm just concentrating on the driving a lot more. Rather than obviously, because even if I'm commentating, of course, all I'm, you know, I'm thinking about what I need to say, of course. When obviously I'm streaming, I'm having to think about responding to things. Any plans to do two and two much? So, this is what I was going to ask Twitch, actually, at some point. Two and two much. Now, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a reasonable man. I, no one in their right mind wants to wear a t-shirt with my face on it. Like, I'm not stupid enough to believe that anyone ever would. But what I thought more about potentially doing is 2-1-2 two two merch, 
but he's more kind of Formula One and motorsport. Like, yeah, have a couple of fun ones, say, for example. Um, you know, just have, like, one with a 212 logo on it or, you know, one with my face on a bottle, you know, a tiny little logo, something like that. But more kind of motorsport-themed ones, you know, that aren't necessarily actually 212 as such, but just kind of cool motorsport designs. But I, I, I guess it's just one of those weird things, because I know I've spoke about it before on stream as well still, um, is, you know, one, one of the big things for me still definitely uh, that I've kind of learned about myself over the last 12 to 18 months is I definitely still have a bit of imposter syndrome when it comes to, you know, this being my job. Um, you know, the fact that I'm sat here on a random Tuesday night talking to... I don't, I don't know how many of you are here, but the fact this is my job, of course, making content every day. You know, I'm kind of there like, surely no one would care if I'm at too and too much. But it, it does come up every once in a while. Cardboard cutouts, dearie me, Alem. <laughs> well, why is that the first thing you ever say on stream? <laughs> well, come on in, mate. That's brilliant. Oh, there we go. Joe into the pits. Ocon is well, no, Ocon's out of pit lane. So we're like a pit stop behind pretty much everyone else. Chat's got all the business ideas. It's a fair point. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that really a warning? Did I get the car slowed down? Yes. Oh, I got a wing and a penalty. We're going to be battling Bottas again, chat. Because I'm bad. At oh, I forgot I was reading chat. Oh, dearie me. Because I'm bad at the game now, Hal. We all know this. Am I going to be beating Valtteri Bottas? Do not DNF. Yeah, my brain has. I mean, like I said, this was kind of just like a good excuse to play F1. Come on, be ahead of Bottas. Be ahead of Bottas. We're ahead of Bottas. Come on, there's a chance. There's a chance. DNF, please. I I intend not to DNF before this race is down and out. Oh yeah, of course I've got worse. I've always said this. I was a better sim racer at 17 than I am now. This is what making content does to you. Like, it genuinely makes you a worse racer. <laughs> it's your job. <laughs> you sound like, what's it, um... Oh, what's his name? They're not, uh, the Irish uh, uh, ex-footballer. Played for Man United. Roy Keane, isn't it? It's his job! <laughs> ah! There's a new strategy available on the MFT. Will I get my lap back? Will the AI pit? We, we, we need Leclerc to box here, otherwise we're in big... Oh! Other, other, otherwise we're in really big trouble. Can I overtake him off the road? Will that work? Oh, not if I do that. Oh, I picked up a penalty doing that. You'll all be fine. We've got plenty of time to save that now. Plus for our lap down. Just the race and go to sleep. I lost 10 viewers. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Does James have more viewers than me? How many viewers is James on? How many viewers are we on? Where's James streaming? I have many questions. Watch you sleep. What is a subathon? Uh, it's just how much of a noob I am with these things. Like, what actually is a subathon? The battle for P19 is heating up between myself and Bottas. Where is he? There he is. We're going to try and have him. Woo! Okay I'm not last! Can I get nine seconds on him? I need a second a lap before the end of this. Oh, right, okay. Can't end till the timer runs out. Maybe next year. Perhaps there's a thing to do next September. Oh, I've got a five second penalty for ignoring blue flags. Uh, right, Bottas is at the back of the train then, is he? We'll try and help a brother, right? No, no. No, thank you, Bottas. Ah! Oh, man. Oh. I mean, yeah, I've just had the setup wrong all night, haven't I? Which hasn't helped. Ah! Oh. 
underbody's taken a little damage. Just watch out. <laughs> safety car, safety car. No overtaking. Reduce your pace. <laughs> How do I get a five-second penalty for that? Okay, listen. Don't worry about it, mate. It can happen to the best of us. Now look, I've put a new strategy option for you in the MFD. So go and have a look. Safety car in this lap. Safety car in this lap. Let's make sure. And like Bottas turns me, <laughs> and I get a five-second penalty. Deary me. <laughs> Oh, six stops. Look at the tyres. <laughs> oh, that's horrendous. Do we get the lap back? I'm on the wrong tyres. Do we get the lap back? Yes, we do. <laughs> See, we've got 19 seconds of penalties. So I can't do anything anyway. But at least we know that now. Uh. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh, dearie me, chat. What a nightmare. I got nothing. <laughs> How do I get another three second penalty? Oh, dearie me. Oh. I think I think what we'll do, I, I think I think we'll 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 retire the car, I think. We'll we'll go raid James early. Ugh. Like this is this has been so much fun. Okay, but such a bad race. Expect to feel a major performance impact. Go to the end. Why is my steering literally shaking down the straight? Oh damn it man. <laughs> Can we be ahead of Nick the Freeze? Tired two one two. I'd still technically get classified from here. So it would be nineteenth last twentieth, I believe. Uh, no, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna mess with the bigger picture. Do we do we just try and get to the end? I mean we're gonna be a lap down, aren't we? I think. Oh, there's yellows! Someone's breaking down! Who is it? I'm not gonna be last! Oh, I'm tired. It's Bottas! <laughs> After all of that, anyway! Valtteri, my friend. No. Why? We've beat Bottas. WWE would be proud of these scripts. It's a fair statement. We're still under on fuel. Oh, man. That's so funny. I mean, yeah, there's still less script in this than an hour of career mode, but, you know. That is so funny. Jack Don's welcome in, mate. Hope you're having a good evening. We've had a nightmare. I, I won't... Oh, no! Are you okay? That was a nasty hit. Turn the engine off and wait for the marshals.
I think I think I think that that does that 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 that's that that probably is <laughs> dearie me. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, oh, everyone that's come in this evening. I'm so sorry to all of you. <laughs> what a nightmare! What a nightmare! Well, I mean, yeah, <laughs> we can't we can't say much else, can we? Apart from, I'm so sorry to all of you that came out tonight. Um, if you've enjoyed, please get yourself following. We'll be back again. Very. Why am I watching the replay? I don't care. Um, we'll be, we'll be back again soon. For Stappen, 21 point lead in the table. I don't know how he's done it, but he has apparently. Uh, there, there's your driver's championship. Albon uh, with another point on the board there, so good job done by him. Um, Red Bull still leading out of the way. We are we are seventh over ahead of Alfa Romeo. I'll be back very soon. Uh, round six, we head to Imola. Hopefully, we can have a better race there. Let, let's just go raid James early. I can't lie. I can't lie. We, we've just got to raid James, haven't we? Raid. Tell him I was bad. Tell him you love him more than me. Um, oh, I've, I'm spamming my keyboard. I will. Uh, so we'll definitely be live Thursday. I might be live tomorrow night as well. I don't quite know just yet. Um, but yeah, I <laughs> like I said, I'm so sorry. <laughs> that was not quite the way I intended for things to go. But tiredness got the better of me towards the end of that, and we have had a nightmare. To finish things off. Where is James Early? There he... Oh, it's James Early YT. I almost put the wrong thing in. Um, James Early YT. Tell him I'm a terrible Formula 1 driver. Tell him he's better than me. Tell him you love him. A massive thank you to all of my YouTube members and my Patreon supporters for their continued donations to help my work. These things go much further than I think a lot of you ever realise and allow me to continue making content full time here on YouTube. So if you want to support me from as little as £1 a month and be featured on all of these end clips, either click the join button next to the subscribe or head over to my Patreon. There's a link down in the description.